the mobile home diva and in today's video i'm going to be touring this deer valley home the name of this home is called the briar ritz all the information that i have will either be on the screen or down in the description box below sorry you can't hear me i'm out on the side of the road but hey that's not going to stop us from seeing how beautiful this home is this is the briar ritz you guys first off look at this porch you got this beautiful porch you can make i would probably make steps come going the whole length of this porch coming down so you can enter from anywhere across that porch is what i would do that'll give you an idea of the length of the porch how much space you got out here to kind of stretch out have rockers or nice set of uh outdoor furniture out here really lovely i would put this stone around the bottom for underpinning you got this these three columns here four columns excuse me really lovely really really lovely i'll go down on this side and let you so all that is your porch then when you go in through the front door this is the view that you see entering into the home. So this is your living room. Lovely archways. That's the front door where we entered. Really lovely. Really, really nice. You've got carpet in this room, but you've got a cutout here to take off shoes which is lovely. And I think this carpet is just laying here. So all of this is flooring. And then you've got carpet over here. Love all the windows. You've got a door right there that could lead out to a nice deck and two big windows in here to bring in light. You've got a real fireplace in here, uh, surrounded by stonework. Love the mantel. And I love the fact that you have space for a huge TV. You could put 75, 85 inch TV up there. Really nice. Love the seating here. That's additional seating. And I even love the built-in. However, I probably, because like, I probably wouldn't put the TV here. I would put it here. So I would want all of this to be shelving so I can have decor and different things, games books, whatever I desire in this area. But really nice. All right, so back over here. Again, as I stated, this carpet is just laying here, right? This is all flooring, and this is service like your foyer area. Really pretty. So from the front door, again, this is the view coming in. To the right, you have your kitchen and dining room. Love that each entry uh, is has its own, each area has its own entry. So you have an open field without it being completely open. This is your dining room section. Beams in the ceiling in here. In addition to a chandelier, two nice large windows for lots of light and lots of space to entertain all your family. You can go as big or as small as you want. You can put two tables in this area. So lovely, really lovely. Off the dining room, you've got your kitchen. Love the butcher block island. Even though it's got the sink in the island, you don't even notice it. Look at all the space on this island. Really lovely. You've got dark wood in here. Love it, love all the cabinets. Always love a corner cabinet. You've got your microwave up top and oven on the bottom. Lots of storage space, a large hood. And I love, love, love the tile backsplash. I love how they did it. This tile here actually looks like brick. Okay. And then you've got the glass tile here. Really nice. Really lovely. You do have pendant lighting over the island, but I love the fact that it's not hanging low. Like, I love that. I look, because sometimes it could be too low, but that's, to me, that's perfect because 
You can either leave it up there or you can hang it a little lower. It's up to you. Really nice. Really nice. All right. Off the kitchen here, you've got like a butler's pantry. Really nice. You can use it for a butler's pantry. This could be a, an office area because you could put a stool or, or a chair under there and have a... a craft area or desk or just place for the kids to do homework this is a separate room for that really nice and it's a lot of space in here so you could add anything else in here that you desire through this door you have pantry that also has a window that's a nice touch it's nice and bright and light in here and you got lots of space for appliances Pantry items, storage items, etc. Really nice. So that's off the kitchen. All right. So that was where we just came from. Back in the dining room, looking at the kitchen. Really nice. Now, off of the living room. We'll go down here first. Down this hallway are your additional bedrooms. To the right, you have your laundry room, large laundry room, really large laundry room. Love it. So you've got your back door there. You've got space over here to fold clothes as well as you have cabinet and drawer space. You've got all of the space over here for whatever you desire. You've got space for your laundry room, excuse me, for your washing dryer there and your upper cabinets. Uh, you have look, what looks like to be a coat. Oh, no. That's your, uh, that's your water heater. That is your AC room. And this is like a linen closet. So really nice. So no coat closet in here. You've got a linen closet. Really nice. All of this, you guys, is laundry room. This is another bedroom, okay? All of this is laundry room. Really lovely. Really lovely. So that's your laundry room. And across from your laundry room, you have a guest bath. Sorry it's so dark. Let's see if the lights are on. Oh, we got lights. All right, this is your guest bath. You've got double sinks in here. Mirrors will go on the wall there. And then you've got your tub and shower combination over there. So really nice. That's your guest bath. And it's across the hall from the laundry room. All right. Going on down the hall, you have guest bedroom number one. So this is your first additional bedroom here whatever you choose for it to be. Got two large windows in here and you've got a standard closet over here. Large, large room, really nice. So that's your additional bedroom, number one. Got another little linen closet area right here in the hall and then you've got a second additional bedroom over here sorry i can't get in there um like i want we got a walk-in closet in here really nice sorry it's so tight but the siding and, and things that complete the house are in this room I know you guys understand. You look at these tours all the time. Very nice. So all of this is your additional bedrooms and your laundry room down that hall off the living room. Also off of the living room to the left and next to the front door. You have a... Uh, coat closet right here there's your 
coat closet. All right, and then your master bath, master bedroom. Love the ceiling, love it, love it, love it. All right, love all the windows. This is your closet in the master bedroom. Again, please overlook all of these items. This is what completes the house. So all of that is master bedroom. And if, if I have pictures online, I'll be sure to post them to give you an idea, you guys. You've got French doors or double doors that lead into your master bath. What a nice feature. Double sinks to the right. Lots of drawer and cabinet space. Next to the sinks, you have this large shower. Now you enter here. Step up one. And then step over into the shower. And all of this is shower space. And I love the window looking out into the bathroom. Honey, hand me a towel. <laughs> Love it. Okay, so that is your shower. Next to the shower, you have a soaker tub. You've got a window that opens above the tub. And then you've got a window that opens next to the tub. Oh, I love all the fresh air that can come into the bathroom. Love it. Your toilet room is in there with a door. <sighs> and the crowd cheers. <laughs> and then behind... The door to come in, you have a linen closet. Really lovely. Nice bathroom, you guys. Nice home. This is the Briar Ritz. It's a Deer Valley home. It's out at Oasis Homes in Augusta, Georgia. Hope you enjoyed the tour. If you're interested in any pricing, specifications, or location of this home, please look in the description box. And the guys at Oasis Home will be happy to assist you. This is a three-bedroom, two-bath. It's also available in a four-bedroom, okay? All right. Thanks so much for watching.